So two weeks on from starting to use the Samsung S20 Ultra 5G, uh, the Z Flip and the XCover Pro, my first review is on the S20 Ultra 5G. All of my reviews are from a business perspective, as there are plenty of consumer reviews of these products, so I'm not reinventing the wheel. So having worked for large uh, telecoms companies for over 25 years now, I'm self-employed, so my opinions are from that point of view. Uh, first impressions were, wow, the screen, uh, the quality of the camera, the build, uh, the battery. Yes, I've used Samsung devices uh, for a long time now, especially the Note series. Uh, I have used Apple also, but it never really met all my needs from a business perspective. In business, there are only two manufacturers that meet data security and enterprise management mobility criteria, and that's Samsung and Apple. And they've been leading the way all along. I'm now self-employed. You think I need a new laptop for my job, uh, you would think. Nope, I had it here in my hand. The S20 Ultra 5G has Samsung DeX built in. What that means is basically this is my laptop. I connect it to this uh, Microsoft Surface Pro, which is about four, maybe five years old, um, but it, it breeds new life into it uh, because I connect a USB-C cable into this and that's my laptop. And people are saying, why would a mobile phone need 12 gig of RAM? For that reason, it's a full-blown computer. Yes, you can get models with 16 gig of RAM as well. Obviously, it'll be more expensive. The security on it is called Samsung Knox. There'll be a link available to find out information on, on Samsung Knox in more detail. This adds a high layer of security, which is built into the device at manufacturer level. So it's at a chipset level. Um, the device also has a secure container on it, so I can store any of my clients' files or information within that secure container and it can't be accessed. So this is a phone and it's a laptop. Now, I can work away with this device. I can have my Bluetooth headset plugged in. I can be taking a phone call. I can work away on spreadsheets or customer information files. And my experience with the 5,000 milliamp battery, uh, it was excellent. So while it's connected to my uh, laptop, it also trickle charges. In a moment, I'll just connect it up just to give you an idea of what it does look like um, so that you can, you can see how good it is. Using the USB cable that comes in the box, you just simply plug it into the side of your laptop. The other end, the USB-C, that then plugs into the bottom of the S20 Ultra. So when I plug it in, you'll see uh, it looking for permission. Uh, on the phone, it'll come up. It's gonna say, it's gonna look for permission to access. Uh, so you can see it here now. You want to start using uh, Samsung DeX. I click start now. On the display of the laptop, you will now see a new desktop just popped up. And that's a full-blown computer. So if I use the mouse, then I can increase the screen. I can get access to all my files, uh, all my applications. So if I just simply click on the application button, there's all my apps that are in there, where I want to go back to the desktop and I want to access my email or my files or my photograph gallery or, or any settings at all. Down here you have all the other functionality, your messages coming in, your battery. You can see that the phone is also charging as well, it's a trickle charge from the laptop. Um, so it keeps the battery topped up because while I'm working on this, I can be working on Word or Excel or any of the, the Microsoft uh, suite of products. Um, I can also take a phone call as well using my Bluetooth uh, headset. Um, so it's fully functional as a computer. Now you can buy additional accessories to the likes of this, which uh, basically is the same thing as the USB cable, but it's got additional functionality. Uh, you've got an Ethernet port and you've got a HDMI port on it as well. So it's just it's a, an additional Samsung accessory that gives you more functionality. My experience of the 5000 milliamp battery was excellent as it uh, takes a trickle charge as well when I have it connected to my laptop, so it keeps uh, the power going in the device. The only negative thing, uh, and I've given this feedback to Samsung, was the fact that the 108 megapixel camera on the back uh, protrudes about a millimeter. It doesn't sit flat on anything. So with a cover on it, yeah, absolutely, it'll be perfect. So that's one of the next purchases, get a, a, a good cover for it. Um, because with a device that's that expensive, you need to have uh, a good cover on your phone. Yes, the device is pricey, but you get a lot for your money. This is my office in a pocket. It's just bring a USB-C cable with me. I can plug it in to the computer or a screen on a client site. Uh, I'm not leaving a digital footprint. Uh, fully secured, fully encrypted. 
The S20 Ultra uh, 5G for me is a 9 out of 10 and I'm excited with the new features on this device making its way into the next version of the Samsung Note series. It's a real powerhouse. So in the next videos we're going to be covering the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip uh, which is quite an exciting device and we're also going to be covering the Samsung uh, X Cover Pro which has a dedicated push to talk button on the side of it. So if you don't want to miss the next videos please click the subscribe button below and hopefully see you soon.